everyone, I'm back from vacation, so I had a few week hiatus here, but I'm getting back into the swing of things. Um, I do have a Sephora haul, as you can see. I have a bunch of perfumes in here to show you. I don't have a Sephora location near me, so I took advantage um, on my vacation, and it happened to be my birthday month, so I was able to redeem my birthday gift too, which was super, super awesome. So yeah, we're just gonna, we're gonna dive right into this. Okay, so this right here is the main reason I went to Sephora. I wanted to get this um, perfume sampler boxes. Now, this wasn't the one I was originally intending to get, but I decided to go with this one because look at you get the cute little mini bottles. I'll take them out, but you get like an actual tiny bottle instead of like those little like tester tube perfume ones. Um, if you know, you know, those little sampler ones you usually get. These are so adorable, and I was smelling in store to see which fragrance I wanted and to get the best value of the ones I liked. This was the box I went with. So if you haven't seen these before, this is the great way to get a discount on fragrances because there's different samples in here. Like this one has six, other ones have many more. But as you can see here, you get a full size at no extra cost. So if you like one of these fragrances, there's like a little um, coupon booklet on the inside and you get one of these for free. So as you can see, I paid $80 for this. So I got one of these full size fragrances for 80 bucks. So if you ever like a scent that's in here, get yourself a sampler box. It's the way to get discounts on these fancy perfumes. Now some of them, the val value is pretty much even um, so really just do your research and see, but yeah, here's what the back of the box looks like. Again, own a full size bottle at no extra cost. So yeah, let me just open this bad boy up and I'll show you what is in here. And then I'll also reveal which one I picked. Okay. So these sets do come with a booklet. So I'm just going to follow the order of this. Um, the first thing in here is you actually get a little candle. I'm not familiar with this brand, so I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but since it was so hot, this is a little bit oily because I think the wax kind of leaked, but um, it is a lavender candle. Let me try to open it. Look it. It's so tiny and adorable. It's a very like luxurious smelling lavender, like pretty perfumey, um, but... I thought that was cute, you know, you know me. I'm I'm a candle girl, so <laughs> I think that one you can't redeem. That's like the only one. It's just like a little bonus they threw in there. Um, but yeah, all right, let's move on to the first perfume because that's what I got this box for. Again, I cannot get over, like, look at this. Also, I'm so sorry my nails are like horrible. They were painted and I went back to work and now they're just awful and I didn't even think of it. But anyways, this is the most adorable little fragrance ever. So this is um, by Clean. It is their scent Skin. So this one is a very warm type of scent. Um, it says here in the booklet, it's inspired by the feeling of a warm embrace. Um, there's creamy Madagascar vanilla um, and a little bit of musk as well. So it says wear alone or layer with other fragrances. Um, but yeah, this one's really nice. It is like a little roller. Definitely warm and definitely something to wear if you like want something that is like a base. I feel like it's a good base fragrance. So that's the first one. Then we have the oh so popular Gucci Flora. This bottle, let me try to take the top off of here. It's like a little dropper. So that one's not a roller, but you guys, look at how cute this is to keep that like in your purse. I am dead. But anyways, um, as this name implies, this is a floral fragrance. Um, it has gardenia, jasmine, pear blossom, and brown sugar accord. Very coveted scent. Um, I thought I would hate this because I am not a gardenia girly. Like I just never have been, but oh my gosh, this smells so freaking good. I love a good floral, but like white gardenia, that candle, and um, 
what other fragrance was it rainforest gardenia yeah like those bath and body works um fragrances i'm just not a fan of um but this i'm so down for it absolutely love the next one is mark jacobs daisy look at her she is so adorable so this is a fruity floral um, it has wild berries, soft white violets, velvety jasmine, and sandalwood. So this is also a very popular scent. Um, this is another one where you just kind of have to like drop it on. Um, but yeah, you guys, I cannot get over these little bottles. But yeah, it's definitely kind of fresh on me. Like I think the fresh notes come out a bit more, but that smells so good. And I see people talk about these fragrances all the time, but I never get to smell them because, like I said, there's just not access for me to smell around here. So this was super cool for me. Then the next one is this itty bitty little nest perfume oil, which I really want to get more into perfume oils. And this one is a little rollerball, but this smells so good. I wanted to use this uh, when I was on vacation because I was in like a hundred and some degree weather. And this is a coconut scent. And it, it has uh, creamy coconut, tiara blossom, and salted musk. This smells so good with my skin chemistry and it makes me want the big size. So they're definitely getting me with this <laughs> sampler box. But yeah, I really like the idea of perfume oils. So I wanna explore those more and I think that's a perfect way for me to do it. Then we have this scent from Fleur, which this is pretty big. Like in comparison to like, the clean they give you a pretty hefty size that's why I like this deluxe box um, so this is their scent missing person it is another warm fragrance it has white musk uh, jasmine orange blossom and some woodsy notes as well I forgot what this one smelled like this one is an actual little spray bottle really nice Definitely good for like the fall season, but yeah, I'm always wanting to like tap into these like more fancy fragrances because I have so much like Bath and Body Works and like Dossier, that brand um, does fragrances inspired by these fancy scents um, and I love those, but to actually have some luxury fragrances myself is super cool and that's why I wanted to do this. And then lastly in there, we have this Versace fragrance. It's Dylan Purple. Look at this little guy it's so cute so this is a fruity floral it has let's see what are the notes on here woodsy notes musk um yeah it doesn't give me the exact types of fragrances on here but i guess they are leaving it more a mystery but let me open this guy definitely fruity floral mm -hmm. very feminine fresh and fruity little bit of musk. This is another dropper style one. So there's that Versace scent. So that's what's all in the box. Now, before I tell you, leave in the comments below, guess which one I picked. Do it right now. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. So here's the one I redeemed. Gucci Flora. The one I least expected to redeem is the one I went with. So I got this for completely free. Um, this is the one floral ounce size. I haven't even opened it yet. Let's just do it. Let me let me just open it right now. Because I didn't want to open it like while I was on vacation because I wanted it to travel back safely. But let's just let's just do it. Let's see the full size bottle. So this is my first like luxury perfume. Um, like I said, I've experienced Dossier, uh, but I haven't actually had like a Gucci scent or anything near that before. And I am so excited. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. I am so freaking excited for this. I can't wait to get my collection back in order. Again, this has been months of our renovation and I did buy another bookcase as well so I can organize my collection even better. I am dying 
to do these organization and collection videos for you, like chomping at the bit. It's coming soon. I'm, I keep saying that like every month, but I am determined. <laughs> but yeah, here she is. She's beautiful. As you can see, there's the notes again on the back, gardenia, jasmine, and pear. I guess it's like the pear for me because I'm a pear girly, but I cannot express how excited I am for that. So that was everything for that. And then here was my birthday gift, which was more perfumes. There was like a glow recipe skincare box, but like I'm a perfume girly. That's that's what I do here. So that's why I decided to go with. There are two Dior fragrances in here. Um, so I decided to get them as well. I'm expanding my little baby mini perfume collection right here. So we have these two, Miss Dior, and I don't want to pronounce that wrong. It looks like Savage, but it's probably like Sauvage <laughs> or none of that. I'm embarrassing. I know. I, I need to do my expensive research here. But this is Old Men's Eau de Parfum, and it smells so good. Um, I'm going to be giving this to my husband immediately. I would wear this. Ooh, it's like spicy. It's good. Quite like that one. And then Miss Dior, let me get her out. This smells really good. I did wear this once already. Oh my gosh. It is so cute. Look at her. Adorable. Yeah, this is a floral. Mm. this little dropper so so good so yeah that is my little sephora haul i hope you enjoyed this different style video um yeah that's pretty much all i got if you have any types of videos you want to see feel free to always leave suggestions in the comments below um because i want to put out what you guys want to watch so yeah thank you everyone and i will see you in the next video bye